Okay, got yet another question from uh, Yahoo Questions regarding Audacity and overdubbing and what that's all about. Okay, well, let's do this. Um, let me see if we can change the settings in here. There we go. <clears throat> all right, now you'll see that you can... Uh, let's do a quick recording, okay? Here we go. There were 10 in the bed, and the little one said, Roll over, roll over. All right, that's great. All right, now we're going to play that recording again. Um... No, I'm going to record that again. Here we go. Ready, set, and go. There were 10 in the bed, and the little one said, roll over, roll over. Now, you noticed that uh, I'm not, not hearing myself at the same time. But you can play them back. There, there were 10, 10 in the bed, bed and the little, little one said, roll over. All right, so they don't match up. Thanks. Um, the reason you're not hearing it is because you need to go up to um, Edit, down to Preferences, under the tab of Recording, and you need to click this little button here, this little tick here, and select Overdub. So now it'll play the other tracks while recording the new one. Got it? Okay, let's try it again. Click OK. Let's hear my wonderful voice again. There were 10 in the bed, and the little one said, Roll over. No, we'll stop there. And now we hit, we go back to the beginning. We hit Record, and you're going to hear this in the background. Here we go. There were 10 in the bed, a little one said, roll over, roll over, roll over. There we go. And that's how you do it. That's the overdub feature. And, of course, when you play it back, there were 10 in the bed, a little one said, roll You're going to hear three voices because this one now represents, there were 10 in the bed, a little one said, the two voices mixed together at the same time because you were playing it and recording it at the same time, thus overdub. Hey, thanks for watching. Appreciate the positive feedback. Bye-bye.